everyone, how are you doing today? My name is Karina and welcome back to Ready, Set, Pam. Today it is time to purge the collection a little bit. I have, what a surprise, more eyeshadows to declutter. Those seem to be the things I declare the most just because I'm cycling through my collection, I'm doing my useless eyeshadow products, and eyeshadow takes so long to use up, so I'd rather other people get use out of these, which is where ideally, hopefully, all of these are gonna be able to go. So I have one, two, three, four, five eyeshadow palettes that are leaving my collection. And we're going to start off with the Violet Voss Violet Sunset Palette. This is a really pretty palette. We've got lots of neutrals. We got pops of purple in there. So you can go colorful. You can also use this every single day and go very like neutral. Just like with the other Violet Voss eyeshadow palette that came in this kind of packaging, which I also decluttered, it just doesn't stay on my eyes. So like the... So the nine pan or 12 pan, but it's like more of a square. It's the All of You Forever palette. That one works so well for me. This one, not so much. So it's gonna go unfortunately, and hopefully someone can get better use out of it. Now the next little palette, it's just a little trio. This comes to us from Elizabeth Arden. This is their Love of Grey 07. As you guys can see, there's a fair amount of use on it, but I think it's just old. I think it's just old. Um, yeah, it doesn't really stay on the eyelids as much. And grays aren't a color I reach for a whole lot on my eyes. Like, I do like gray tones in the winter, but I've got other grays. Like, so, oh, yeah. So this one, unfortunately, is going to go, like, this is obviously the prettiest shade in there, but that's okay. That's okay. I am also going to declutter. I had purchased this one myself. This is from Quo Beauty. This is their eyeshadow palette in Cherry Balm. <sighs> Again, it just doesn't perform as well as other palettes that I have. You can see how much I had to dig into this shadow. I've only used it a couple of times, you guys. But I was really trying to build it up all over the lid. So, it's just, it's gotta go. It's not gonna work for me. Um, like, I could make it work. But again, I have so many other eyeshadows that I'm not going to. I did buy it on Clear Out, but someone else can get more use out of it. And I'm not as big on some of these more red tones on the other side, so we'll pass on that. Now, Wander Beauty, your eyeshadows don't seem to like me. Um, this is the Wander Beauty Trail Blazer Eyeshadow Palette. And it is oh, it's stunning, you guys. Look at that. Now, the last Wander Beauty palette I ripped apart, I did keep like all of like the shimmery goodness. This palette, the mattes perform better than the shimmery goodness. Like, so all of these shades don't really want to stay on my eyes, which are un which is unfortunate. So I'm not gonna mess around with it. I'm not gonna pull out mattes. Like, especially, like, obviously, Noreen here is a unique one, but I'm not going to get a ton of use out of it. So I'd rather pass this along for someone else to get use out of. So, yeah, I use this one a little bit more than No Pam Left Behind to really test it. But I got too many to kind of, too many eyeshadows to mess around. Now, this last palette that I'm going to declutter, this is from Trey Luce Beauty. This is their Calmness palette. And I'm decluttering this for a different reason. So these eyeshadows do perform very well on my eyes. It's a nice little travel size palette. I spent points on this in the BoxyCharm shop. It's just not my color story. Like this, this, like these are very orangey kind of colors. I've got tons of these kind of bronzy colors. So it just gives a more orange warm look, which I don't think is as flattering on my skin tone. So Great palette, just wrong color story for me personally, but works so well. So I would actually recommend this palette if you like more of those warm toned looks. So those are the five palettes that are going to be getting out of my collection. They've been out of my eyeshadow spreadsheet since I decided that they were going out. So we're just going to keep moving on and keep trying more stuff. Of course, with these declutters, once I have five beauty items, I will then come to you guys with another video and kind of talk you through why I am decluttering. Of course, I will try to rehome these so that someone else can get good use out of it and to minimize the waste. So if you enjoyed this video, make sure you give it a big thumbs up, subscribe so you don't miss my next video. I look forward to seeing you guys in the next one very soon. Have a wonderful day.